Hey guys, today I want to talk to you about the hamburger sound post. I know I promised to make this post a while ago, but uh, I got sidetracked busy with other stuff. But anyway, here it is. I actually saw this on Linus Roth's Instagram first. And I thought it was the coolest thing. I love nerding out about anything that's new or innovative about violin playing. So I went ahead and I contacted Mr. Hamburger himself personally. And uh, I went to visit him in Munich and he was he's the nicest guy. He actually even installed the sound post himself for me. So the hamburger sound post is a sound post made of composite material and its height is adjustable. You adjust it with a wheel. Actually, I'll just show a video that's probably easier to demonstrate. So here you can see the sound post being put in place by magnets from outside of the violin. Then by turning the wheel, you adjust the height, after which you lightly press on the two plates which adjusts the feet, and ta-da, there it is. It's actually very easy to install. I was playing around with it quite a bit myself to find the ideal adjustment that works for me the best and works for my playing style the best. I think it actually sounds tremendous. I think it sounds better than ever. You can really tell that the fit is just perfect because of those flexible feet. And uh, yeah, but definitely you should have had some experience of uh, knowing how the position of the sound post affects the sound. So whether you want to move more towards the bridge or from away from the bridge, closer to the F holes or away from the F holes, like you should definitely look into that before you before you start experimenting around. There was even a time when I was making my own sound post, just cutting them out of wood. And uh, that's probably a bit extreme, but I guess I'm just crazy like that. Anyways, if you have any questions about it, just write in the comment section or contact Mr. Hamburger himself. I hope this video helps. And uh, see you in the next one, I guess. Bye.